can't believe I didn't do this any faster. Obito, one of the best known anime characters out there, is literally my favorite, one of my my actual favorite character in all of Naruto. You got Madara, he trash. You got Naruto, he trash too. And you got Sasuke. People think, oh, he the dark Uchiha, nah, he trash as well. Obito is where it's at, and I'm here. <gasps> hey. Hey guys and gals, Gaming to here and today once again we're doing a reaction video. Today we are here with the Obito rap from Fable on my own featuring Dizzy8. So, hope you guys and gals go into the description down below, check it out for yourself, and let's get it in. Okay, yo, I gotta say, Obito, in my opinion, has literally the greatest, or shall I say, actually one of the greatest, like, backstories in all of Naruto. Guy died and somehow came back to life. I don't know exactly how he came back to life. Maybe y'all can leave that in the comment section down below. But he came back to life and searched for his friends. Then after he found out Sasuke, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> that uh atachi nope kakashi oh my god what atachi kakashi actually does kind of sound the same either way uh kakashi killed um the girl or whoever she was that obito wanted him to protect then but it was because uh you know uh the girl got controlled or basically made uh kakashi do it or tricked him into doing it either way Either way, after a long while, uh, Obito came up with a plan. He opened and made the Nine Tails go crazy. He joined the uh, Akatsuki. Yeah, <laughs> Akatsuki. Okay, okay, I'll get it correctly. Uh, and he did some de devilish shit. He did some devilish shit. And then he also brought back Madara and started the whole revival war, or whatever, where all the um, all the freaking uh, Okages came back. And even, um, even, um, some other guys came back, like, uh, Sasuke's brother and, and, and some, some other haters, okay? Some other people. Basically, people from the dead were getting revived, and there was this whole war about it and stuff. And I'm not gonna lie, that was fire, and that was flame flow. Now, Obito, he's trying to control things. He wants things to happen. He has a fire within him, rage, that if used correctly, could have took down everyone. And in my opinion, Obito had the strength to take down everyone. And even I know there is a dimension where he he won in the end. to 
been lied to Left to the dentist, I like you Back on my feet just to spite you Filled with this rage and filled with regret I'm stuck in a cage, there's nothing else left Get turned to a page and I haven't read I'd rather be saved than down with the vest I don't give a fuck who bring your goddamn army No shinobi in the world could ever fucking harm me First time I thought that the felt that I would change my life So the second time I see the reaper I'ma make this right, bring the fire, fire Now let me go, let me go back let me go Oh okay so as it was saying like fire fire and stuff like that lyrics were also being placed underneath it Okay okay I see I see now I got to say I feel the rage I feel the rage and I feel the emotion in this song that really does correlate with Obito Obito has always been a guy that is calm and knows what his plan's gonna do. He knows what he wants and he knows what his plan's gonna end up doing once he finishes it correctly, of course. He's a guy that's calm and composed, but he's also a guy that has a lot of rage within him for that man, Kakashi Sensei, and he's trying to beat his ass because he killed one of his friends that, well, actually, you know what? Uh, Obito thinks Kakashi betrayed him throughout most of the uh, the season where you see him and stuff. So basically, after a while, I'm ba I'm very sure they become friends again or later team up to take down either Madara or someone else because now he knows the truth. Now he knows the truth of what Kakashi did and what he meant or um, that it was a mistake and that someone else made him do it, basically. But, you know, Obito, he fire, he good, he clean, he deserved to live. And I know there's a dimension where he does live and maybe even becomes one of the, the greatest warriors of the leaf or something. <laughs> Probably even becomes another rival with Guy and Kakashi. Because, you know, Guy and Kakashi's rivalry, they, got, they are pretty close friends, I'll say. Maybe Obito would have been a part of that. Shoot, maybe, maybe. Anyway, I hope you guys and gals like, subscribe, and enjoy this wonderful video. And if you did like, subscribe, don't forget to hit the bell. All right, but subscribe when to get all my notifications when I blow next. Anyway, I'm Gaming T, aka GT, and I will see you guys and gals oh, later.